Hello, this is Jack from Gadget Factory, and uh, this video is showing the Papilio Arcade prototype. And uh, the Papilio Arcade is based on the Papilio 1. Uh, the Papilio 1 is an open source and modular FPGA development kit, um, and it allows the use of uh, what we call wings, which allow you to you know, add functionality as you need it. And uh, when you bundle all that functionality, together you get a kit and this kit is designed for people who want to recreate classic arcade games um, the FPGA actually allows you to accurately recreate games like Pac-Man, Donkey Kong, Frogger, Asteroids and even the Atari 2600 and the NES platforms can be recreated um, so just to kind of show you all the different elements we have here this is the Papilio 1 FPGA board um, this here is an audio wing which provides um, stereo audio and it uses a Delta Sigma DAC for high quality audio output. This is a joystick wing. Um, this joystick wing allows any joysticks like a Atari 2600 joystick or a Commodore 64 um, or even classic arcade joysticks like classic Pac-Man joysticks and that sort of thing can be plugged in with this DB9 um, serial port connector. Uh, and this is VGA and keep in mind this is a prototype and that's why you see all these resistors. Um, but we took an existing VGA wing that we had that, that only allowed for eight colors at once and we added some more resistors, nine more resistors and we were able to get 4096 colors uh, with the addition of these resistors and the next revision will have this all uh, integrated into one wing. So uh, that pretty much goes over the hardware and I'm going to turn this camera around and show an example. We've got Pac-Man actually running. Um, so you can see I'm just going to use the Atari 2600 joystick and actually I have the volume turned on. Uh, yeah, so you can see that, uh, you know, with an FPGA you get very accurate recreations of the, of the hardware. Um, you can actually take all the circuitry that was in the original motherboard and shrink it down, uh, to fit into one FPGA chip and, uh, it's pretty, pretty amazing. So anyway, I hope uh, people enjoy this and uh, we, we hope to keep working on it and make it available very soon. Thank you. Bye.